Grand Bazaar is not closed yet. It's still open and it's still lots of shops around. It's still ready for you. It's end of season, but the shop's still here. Don't worry about it, guys. And they're not gonna get closed till, say, November, you know? They will still open. If you come around here, around this time, the Grand Bazaar is still waiting for you. We try to find out where is the good shops, where is the best shops, we'll show you. Stay with me to the end of the video so you can find out more about the Grand Bazaar and the shops. As you are next to Grand Bazaar, there's a statue right there and that taxi stop here and the Grand Bazaar first entry there, second entry there. But I'm gonna walk you through just right here if you see lots of jewelries around the marmaries. I'm gonna make a video about the jewelries. The best jewelry in the marmaries is a gold center. And I'm gonna tell you why later on. I'm gonna go make a video about that so you know more about the jewelries. Stay with me for uh, jewelry if you wanna know how good is the jewelry in Turkey and how much is the jewelry and stuff. But I wanna bring you from down along these roads to the glass shop. You wanna find the optician, where is the good pass optician and the prices, how cheap they are, they're just right here along these roads. As you see, I did an entry, no and ent don't entry the Grand Bazaar, just along the way you walk in and you get here. It's an Elite Ice original sunglass store and just right next to it, Kral Optic. They have one, two, three, four glass shops and they've been here for many, many years. This is Marmara is one of the glass shops you should definitely entry. Yes. Prescription glasses, if you're looking for, you don't need your prescription, you can get just your glasses and get the prescription, get done here, because they have a machine for it. Oh. Maybe you want a, a sunglass as well, just right here as well. You're gonna find a lot of glasses you're looking for right here and much 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 cheaper than wherever you are around Europe or maybe you're from UK just come and visit it and you will see what I'm talking about This is Kral Optic. Uh, come here guys, you'll find the Oglitz to ride by. Much cheaper than UK. Why is the tax difference of the this kind of things is different than UK or Europe, you know? That's why it's cheaper it will be. So we're gonna ask the he is the owner of this shop. Hello sir. How are you? How much is the glasses difference price than UK? Thirty percent cheaper than Europe. Oh, it's a third person. How is cheaper than Europe? Europe international and the real one. Thirty percent cheaper than Europe. So because of price. tax, this is because of the tax different guys. It's like a not as much as tax on the glasses and the jewelry in Turkey than the Europe or UK, wherever you are, is gonna be about 30% cheaper. Just saying, so you know, you wanna get in this shop? I showed you where it is. If you wanna know more about this kind of stuff, tax me if, when you're here. I will send you location if you want, but I showed you where it is. I'm gonna show you again, just right next. It's in the Grand Plaza, but you don't have to go in the Grand Plaza. It's along the way. And this is quality and stuff they have here. But you can have a lenses as well.
and it's just right in front of the boat. Like where the boats are, in front of that Medusa boat or Happy Happy Divers, uh, here is the glass shops. Not the first entry of the Grand Plaza, not second entry, just walk along this road and this is the Kraloptik. But it's not just here, it is one more Kraloptik when you entry from this third one to Grand Plaza. There's an optician there as well and it's called Kraloptik, it's the same owner. Why I'm showing you these ones because uh, they're from where I'm from, you know, Martin. Like to help local people, they've been here about more than 30 years. We're gonna entry for you at the Grand Plaza. Not the first, not the first one, not the second one, third entry of the Grand Plaza. Let's go together. Have a look there. What is for you there? Stay with me, turn on the video so you can find out. There's a couple of shops I'm gonna show you. I think might you'll find something you like. Happy days, every day. In here, you will find the good shop. If they're here, 30 years, they should say everything, isn't it? And an entry here at the Grand Bazaar. You will see this orange yellow. This one. I showed you the other day. Where is the glass shop? There's a post office just right here. Might you buy lots of stuff and you want to send to the UK or you want to send to Europe, you can enter the post and you can pack your stuff before you enter it, write your address, name and surname and everything, and you can post it to wherever you are too so it's much easier for you guys where is it it's grand bazaar here the mosque just right here is the mosque one of the mosques in marmaris right next to the mosque there is lots of shops what i'd like to show you this is a plate shops like uh, the uh, what, what do you call it? A china plates and stuff. Just right here. So he's here, this gentleman. Hello, sir. How are you? Hey, my friends, welcome. I'm so, everything. can you tell us what about these guys? The yes, things. Side pieces is the traditional 15th century culture, the Ottoman art. We say that uh, mostly we produce for palace and for church, for mosque. Also for 16th century, produced for aristocrat Ottoman family. Wow. But since 50 years, we produce for rich Turkish family, and now we produce for tourists as well. Uh, long up the 15th century culture, does one, well. and it's starting for one pound, till we have for 400, 500 pound as well. Wow! This is all uh, belong of the Isdik art. We say that traditional Ottoman pattern. Also, we have new production one, like that, for example. This technique, 20th century technique. This technique, 20th century technique. But those one is 15th century technique. Those type pieces, long of the 15th century classical one. Also, which is the my Turkish blue, not like a Holland, not like a Europe. Those type blue, we have three colors. One is the light blue turquoise, we say. One is the blue, and one is the cobalt. It's like a black cobalt color. This is this one there. There's this traditional Turkish blue and white pottery. Also, now we produce multicolor brown, purple, black, red, every color. Now we produce that. So what I as, what is this like? All this decoration, house decoration? This one, even for investment pieces, there's a 15th century shape. The name is Tirwas. Only you can see this shape in Turkish culture. And this is the for decoration pieces, those one mostly for investment pieces that wow. traditional blue and whites and colorful. Also we have something like this technique too. Those one is mostly for decoration pieces. Also you can your tea as well that you can make your nice tea as well, you can drink that. And those type pieces also we have that. Those one is 20th century technique. The over the glaze painting we say that. This technique, over the glaze painting. There's also 20th century technique, but, but the other one, something like that, we say under the series technique, is when you can use this for thousand, thousand years. Oh. Like our glass, the pattern under the glass, like a pattern under the glass, like a tattoo. Wow. You know, so we cover it with the glaze 950 degrees, 
850 degrees. Approximately one day in the oven, one day clay produce, one day the wheat dry, and the two, three days the workmanship is going approximately five, six days later, the one plate going ready. Also, we have something like that. The most detailed work in my culture is that artist that you say that. There's the most finest details, coronation design inside that. It's for collection pieces, also for investment pieces. Also now we have those one too, the blue and white, that one. The, we use nanotechnology for that one. When we're going to close your electric, this plate going like a moon, moonstone, somebody say that. Shining. Shiny stuff. Also nice decorative for in the night time. There's the details as well that this 20th century technique with the brush, with the palm technique, you see that? Something like that also. Also we have English culture shape, <laughs> but this pattern is Turkish, not English. It's traditional for parts of stuff or something like that. Yeah. Also we have something for breakfast stuff like this. One star in the middle and six pieces beside that. Under that we have plate for party stuff, something like that. Oh, and for use, also. for drink, for like presents, you know. For the gift and presents and... Uh, for everybody, useful. And this black and white is my own work. I do myself this black and white. Nobody has in Turkey this black and color, black and gray color. There's a unique one. Unique color. You know, this is the, my own idea. Since 10 years I sell this one in Turkey. Wow. I have one friend, she said to me about for black and white. Black and white kitchen very popular in England. There's a reason you produce black and gray color as well. For home decoration. We have every colors because now as the cultures change. Somebody want red, somebody like pink, somebody like turquoise. For everybody we have a Nice. Now also we add this one too. Now we can see with the light in my shop. Wow. That's more brighter. More brighter, more shiny, more nicer. <laughs> now the end of the season, some stuff already finished. And that's why it's some yeah. finished, but there's lots of things here, guys. If you yes. like the like gift stuff, or if you maybe you like it yourself. Culture pieces, if you like culture Turkish pieces, culture. bring it your to home for like a, uh, as a gift or for yourself. Well, how do you pack this? Like, the people are gonna we scare. Have something like that. We have bubble wrap. So they get bubble wraps. We have that box. Even we have something like this box. We have that. And the boxes. And they like this box. We have that as well. All right. And, and do, you send, do you send this to UK as well, or you around Europe if they're asking for it? Yeah. Oh, so we can send that too. Okay. My ministry artists, those type pieces. This design, the artist, he make himself that. It's not belong of the copy of the book, not replica stuff, that. It's a unique design. It's a unique pattern, this pattern, something like this pattern is unique as well, you know. And this shop been here for a long time, guys. Since 97. Since 97, it's here, been here, it's been 30 years, it's been here. Like I told you, if they've been here for a long time. Inside the post office. Where we are, I showed you the entry as a post office street we are in so at your entry there it's just right here next to the watch center shop that's gonna be here and where we were going the crawl optic thank you very much see you later man see you later if you like it he will give you this are you gonna give this guy how much person you giving this guy uh, for the channel like a, for channel 40 person Wow, guys, if you use the channel name, you get a 40% discount as well. Put the channel name, tell them you're coming from YouTube. It will give you some discount as well. Happy to have, I want to help local people. And this one, John, nice gentleman. I think uh, you should definitely visit if you like that kind of stuff. And I showed you, Kral Optic. This is one more Kral Optic, just right here at the post office street. I showed you the other one, and I like to show you this one. As you see, this is the one of the best glass shop in the Marmis, they have a couple of just right here at the Grand Bazaar. I hope this video has been helpful to you. I've been around this street. I like to show you two, three shops, but I'm going to show you the jewelry later on. 
after this video stay with me so you can find out where is the jewelry what is the jewelry like and how they do it and what the price is like and the, the quality and stuff how is it and what the discount you're gonna get as well stay with me be with me enjoy with me put the comments down below which shop is your favorite shop at the grand bazaar where do you like the shopping at the grand bazaar maybe next video will be about that happy to help enjoy may enjoy night never goodbye just see you later